bag, you bag. Baka, 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 baka. Hey everyone, do you watch anime and have that one character that you just want to call a baka? Baka. Well, look no further. I made my own series called Baka of the Day. Where I go on little rants talking about certain anime characters that really grinds my gears. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Welcome, welcome. Hey everyone, this is Yosemite Sams here. We're doing another Baka couple of the day, guys. So let's do another episode and see who I have here. As you can see, the two people on there, they look real dumb. I know they're saying, and action. Oh. So Baka couple of the day is Sana and Takeshi from Kodocha. So why are they back a couple of the day, you guys? Well, let me tell you this right here. They weren't a real couple. It wasn't a real relationship. Let's get into why. We're going to state the obvious. He's a grown <laughs> man. This is a grown <laughs> man dating a child. She was only, I think she was 12. And you know what that's called? A pedophile. <laughs> Let's just keep it real. This man's a pedophile. This is pedophilia right here. He's a grown man dating a child. So let's just get into like a short little backstory. Sana is a child actress. She's been acting since she was three years old. She's been living with her mom all that time. She actually made a deal with her mom or the mom gave her the idea to be the greatest child actress by the time she turns... um 12 or 13 i think it was 12 anywho long story short that's what she became it's been up and up and down roller coaster for her but she still persevered and she's still able to do her job and love her job in the middle of her job this is where she met take so she has a history of dating grown men and she actually thought she was in a relationship with her manager ray um, because she found him outside living like a bum and she took him in, gave him a home and when her mother approved, of course, and made him her manager and he's been doing very well with her. But of course, acts as if he's in a relationship with her because he feels in debt to her because of what she did for him. That's cool and all, but why you got to act like y'all in a relationship? That's not cute. It's not cute for a child going around saying, hey, this grown man is my boyfriend. He picks me up. I give him money, this and that. Like they weren't hoeing or anything, but that's what she would say. And then she will also call him a pimp. She, she don't know what that word means. Even her best friend Akito said, do you even know what a pimp means? <laughs> do you know what that word means? No, she don't. And it just really wasn't cute. Sana doesn't know what it's like to have a father or a male figure. And by that backstory, you can understand why. Once she met Take, they both felt an instant connection. And of course, said to the media that they're in a relationship. I'm glad they didn't show anything romantic because that would it would have took a turn for the worse, I believe, with this anime. There were numerous times that this old man should have told this 12 year old girl to go home first night he took her to his home and they slept together in bed oh, hold on hold on hold on hold on now hold on now they didn't have sex he found her sleep on a bench outside but still that was inappropriate of him to do like the next scene you see in the anime it's them two sleeping in the bed and she's wearing his shirt. What, what, are, what are the viewers supposed to believe? Here comes the biggest spoiler. <laughs> what the? He finds himself in the hospital and one of those paparazzi people like from TMZ came to, came to him and told Take that he's going to die soon and you need to know that Sana is your daughter. Bum, bum, bum. What's funny is the mom knew at this particular time as well. The mom, Sana's mother knew, but she didn't tell Sana. She didn't tell Sana. And I'm like, bro, your child is dating her father, but don't even know it. Let's move on to the last part. Sana and Take 
had one last act to do for this drama series, which they play as father and daughter. Hmm. How ironic. And Take says how he has never finished an acting project, right? He's always quit before the end. And despite his health, he wants to see this one through. So he did the last scene while he pushed himself to death, literally. And even though his character died in the scene, he went ahead and died in real life. Like how selfish is that? You were just told that Sana is your daughter. And then you go about your selfish needs to be with her for five minutes and die acting as her father instead of actually being her father. What a sham. What a sham of a relationship. And poor Sana, she, she was never told the truth. But luckily for her Genki character, she mourned one day and he was never thought of or seen after that. So glad it was like that for Sana, but kind of weird. Like the anime could have been done way better with that part. Like you show this man for a brief second, he dies. We found out that it's actually her father. She mourns one day her, that her friends help her through. And then after that, he was never thought of or seen again. Like that was very poor on the animation part but so baka couple of the day goes to sana and take from kodocha <laughs> give it up everybody just give it up you want to hear what a baka couple sound like we'll listen to this clip here mr gojo don't you think that 30 years is too much of a gap where there is love, age doesn't matter, sir. That's right, and besides, I won't be in elementary school forever. I'm going to middle school soon, and that's practically high school. Middle school, middle school, middle school. <laughs> oh, okay, so good. All right, thank you everyone for tuning in on my next, on the next episode I had of Baka of the Day, or Baka Couple of the Day. It is time for a give and take. Who do you think or who would you rate as the most baka couple of the day in anime world? Please put a comment down below. Let's discuss. Have a little debate here. And that's it. Thank you so much, guys, for coming on to this anime series with me. And bye.